Starsha tab. And today I'm going to teach you how to create an email opt-in link. So the first thing you're going to do is log into your editor, click on edit theme, scroll over your links, click to edit, and this will bring you to the links and pages section. You're then going to add a new link and you're going to choose the email opt-in link. So you're going to go ahead and click on that and then we can edit the section. So at any time you can make this section visible or hidden. You can change the link type here and then right here, I'll just go ahead and take this off for a second so you can see. So an example to, to put right here is into your email. So I would highly suggest that you just use that because essentially that's what this link is for and I'll show you in a minute. And then you can always um, change that if you wish, okay? So you're gonna click save. And then once your followers um, enter the first email, you're gonna get these black bars. And these are the files that are holding and collecting all the emails that are um, going through your link. So you can go ahead and download them and use them as you wish. It will also tell you above how many subscribers you have. And this section is really good if you want to notify your clients of a certain event, a certain new book, um, things like that, or if you want them to subscribe so that they can re receive your newsletter. There's so many different ways that you can use this. And again, collecting emails is really great for any business. So I highly recommend that you add this to your Socia tab. And then we're gonna go back to the editor and we can see the button right here. And so at any time, you can make this link visible or invisible. You can edit it, you can delete it. You can look at the analytics for this section and you can hold down the arrow and move the link to any position, okay? And so then we're gonna click on this little phone and we're going to go and just look at how we edited our link in real time. So this is the, the call to action right here is I want them to enter their email and then once they enter their email, they'll click subscribe and it will go into your editor. And I just want to take you back there and I want to remind you that to find the subscribers that have added their email, it's going to be in this section in these two black boxes, okay? And then you just click on them, click on them, and then you can download them and use them as you wish. So we're just going to click out, we're going to go to menu and go to support. And I just want to remind you that this is where you can send a support ticket in. Um, if you need anything, we're here to help you. I truly believe we have the most incredible customer service. So um, it's really important to us. We really want to help you and we never want you stuck. Okay. And if you have questions, we're here to help you. I can make individual tutorials for you. Um, and we love feedback and we love testimonials and we love um, wishes and wants. And at the end of the day, this product is yours and we want to make sure that it's serving you well. Okay, so have a great day.